Hello everyone, welcome back with AutoCAD 3D Modeling Basic Tutorials for exercise number 2. Okay, first in here I will uh, create new drawings. You can click here and I will use a cut ISO template. The next, don't forget to active your object snap. You can tap DS to open a drafting settings and you can active this all snap options. Click OK. In here I will create rectangles. Start from this point and you can set for length into 142. For width, we can set into 92, and you can press enter. Okay. The next, I will quad circle. Start from this point. We can set radius into eight, and you can use move command to move uh, this object to the right here. Set into 21. Move again to the bottom. We can set into 21. Now we can use uh, mirror command. You can tap mirror, press enter, select uh, this circle. We can mirror start from middle point to the bottom and uh, we mirror again these uh, two circles from this point to the left here. Okay, I will use a fillet command, we can tap fillet and we can set radius into 10. Use uh, multiple options and then I will fillet in uh, this corner also at this point in the bottom and the last at this corner. Okay. Now you can orbit uh, these objects and to convert into 3D we can use extrude tools you can tap extrude press enter select all objects enter again and you can set extrusions into uh, 14 press enter the next we can use a subtract command you can tap subtract we subtract this object press enter with this cylinder object enter again so it will be correct holes. You can change special style in here into set with edge. Okay. The next I will change again into 2D wireframes and I will create rectangles in here. We can set for length into 15 and for width into 92. Now you can use a rotate command to rotate this object from a center points. Use a copy option, tap C, press enter, and I will rotate into 90 degree. Okay, we can move these uh, two object from this point into center point in here. You can sort in middle points also in here and connect into center point. Okay, the next use uh, extrude tools to extrude uh, this object to the top about 40 and press enter. I will use a union command to combine these uh, all objects into one. Okay. The next, uh, we can use a uh, chamber edge. You can tap uh, chamber, okay, chamber edge. Click here. And then I will set for distance chamber into 15 and 15. The next, you can select at this edge. Click in here at this point and the last in here. You can press enter to apply. We can uh, change into set with edge and we create uh, this uh, simple object. The next, I will create circle. Okay, start from the center point. You can click from center point in here. And then you can move into here. We can extrude this uh, circle. To the bottom in here, I will set into 10. Use extrude command again, press control button, and select this face to the top. It's set into 10 again. Okay, now I will create circles in the center points, and we can set in here radius into 20. Use uh, extrude command to extrude this circle to the top. In here, we can set into 30. And the next, we create circles from uh, this uh, center point. And we can set radius into 10. Press enter. Use uh, extrude command to extrude circle object to the bottom here. Okay, we can set into 70. Okay. I will change into 3D wireframes. And then you can use a subtract command to subtract these objects, one, two, three, and four, press enter. 
we subtract with this cylinder object and you can press enter so it will be create holes you can change into set with edge and it will be create holes the next i will use a fillet edge command in it we can set radius for fillet into two and you can fill it at this edge okay, you can select one by one this edge the next at this point and then you can orbit click at this edge now you can press enter to apply okay we already create this uh, simple 3d models for exercise uh, number two with autocad software and if you have any question about this tutorial you can comment below this video